it's not so easy to check your blood pressure. So here's how you have to do it. Blood pressure is a dynamic number. It's, it's, you know, never high. Well, it's normally high sometimes, normally low sometimes. A lot of times right in the middle sometimes. It depends on what's going on. It depends on your body's position, how you're breathing. Are you tense? Did you just have a cup of coffee? Did you just work out? Are you upset over something? What's your emotional status? What did you just eat? There's all kinds of things that cause that blood pressure to adapt to what's going on in your body. And sometimes that adaptation means it gets a little higher. Sometimes it gets lower. Uh, and other times it's it's just all on a continuum. But it's so crazy because I we, what we saw is somebody's blood pressure might be 170 high, okay? And 15 minutes later be 120. So that shows you that it's just checking your blood pressure periodically is there's a certain amount of error that you're going to get in doing that because you might check your blood pressure at some time and it'll be higher and you think oh my god i've got high blood pressure so that the next time you go check it you're worried you have high blood pressure and that worry causes it to be high again it's not so easy to check your blood pressure so here's how you have to do it you got to do it a bunch of times and then you look for the median you look for the mean level. It's the mean level that is your real blood pressure number. So if you're 170 sometimes, and you're 120 sometimes, and then you're 140 sometimes, if you add all those up over all day long, so you, and, and then you look at the median and the average blood pressure, if that's over 140 or 145, to that degree of high blood pressure, that's the single most accurate way to check your blood pressure. And a lot of times what we find out is people are on blood pressure pills that don't actually have a blood pressure problem.